Well, today is February the 9th. Uh, we're in London. Uh, we're currently working on a project uh, with St. Martin's College in London. This year we decided exceptionally to uh, ask the St. Martin's School of Fine Arts um, to look at the project of the Christmas design for our windows uh, and see what kind of schemes would eventually come out of this work. What is interesting about this sort of collaboration is that a client like Louis Vuitton can get the most out of an art college where the students come from all over the world so they get a truly global picture of creativity and the students, you know, they all have something different to bring to it. This year we want to do it a little differently. So rather than using the same formula of working with an artist every year, this year the challenge is to work with some new and upcoming talent. Uh, we know that there's incredible uh, talents here that have come through this school, that are in this school today. Um, we also know that uh, it is a school that drains international students. Uh, so we thought that it would be interesting to have very different points of views uh, looking into uh, the design of the windows. At this moment in time, we're looking for one student who will produce the windows that works around the world but it could be that depending on what we see, that we, we, we choose more than one idea. When you think Louis Vuitton, you definitely think luxury, and so that was very interesting for us because it's such a big name to work with. Louis Vuitton is, is a big symbol. It does, I don't know if, if it doesn't mean lots for me. I mean, it means graphically, you know, the monogram is already part of pop culture. It's always very interesting to explain what the brand is about and to see what other people think of the brand from the outside. So it, we always, throughout the year, we always use outside freelance work to regenerate, to bring in new ideas, new techniques, new impressions, and also to give well, an outside view of somebody who is not from the inside. What do they think about the brand? I don't think the students realize quite what a huge accolade this is to do. I mean, it is just such a fantastic opportunity for them in terms of publicity, in terms of experience. I mean, how many people get the chance to do a job like this in the real world? I mean, so few. This is huge. And I don't think it's quite hit them as to what a great job it is. Well, I think it's incredible that um, it would be, for example, Olafur Eliasson in 2006 and potentially a new student for 2007. And who knows, we may find uh, one of the most established artists of tomorrow. That's part of the excitement of doing this project, is that somewhere within that room, there is somebody that will, I'm sure, be world famous tomorrow. Notre philosophie, c'est le concept unique, la vitrine unique, sachant que, comme toute règle, il y a des exceptions. Donc là, il nous a semblé que le, la démarche de cet étudiant, c'est l'un, vous le savez, est espagnol, l'autre irlandais, donc je veux dire, ils sont multi, c'est une équipe multiculturelle, euh, est partie sur l'idée du voyage et appelant leur vitrine latitude-longitude, reprenant d'ailleurs le point exact de l'atelier d'Anière, qui est un petit peu la matrice universelle de toute l'histoire de, de Louis Vuitton. Euh, ce concept du voyage, bah, il nous a semblé universel et adapté euh, au monde entier. Donc c'est un pari de confier euh, l'ensemble de nos vitrines de Noël à, cette, euh, à ce projet des deux étudiants, mais euh, dans le même temps, certains autres projets qui nous semblaient intéressants et qui sont plus ponctuels donneront lieu euh, eux aussi à telle ou telle vitrine dans tel ou tel euh, magasin du monde. Donc le premier projet, c'est une espèce de miroir un peu brisé et qui donne des reflets euh, totalement déformés du produit qui est présenté dans la vitrine, mais aussi du passant qui regarde la vitrine. Et euh, nous allons mettre ce projet sans doute au magasin de New York euh, Fifth Avenue. Un deuxième projet qui a retenu notre attention s'appelle Rêverie. C'est 
en fait une idée très très originale qui fait passer une vidéo à travers des caissons ou des mâles remplis de fumée. Un troisième projet qui a retenu notre intention est un projet qu'on appelle Flipboard et qui nous permettra de faire passer des messages sur le voyage, sur, euh, sur Vuitton, puisque évidemment c'est un symbole cher à Vuitton puisque ça traite du, du sujet du voyage. Et, euh, et donc ces deux derniers projets vont être mis euh, l'un au champs élysées et l'autre au magasin de Landmark à Hong Kong. Euh, je crois que Stephen Bryan nous a tous euh, interpellés quand euh, on parlait un petit peu de théorie de vitrine et qu'un jour il nous a dit « Remember, uh, the, the window uh, is the invitation, but the store is the party ». Et ça, je crois que ça restera toujours valable. Voilà.